How do you slow cook a roast in a tractor trailer? We're gonna find out. Oh Lord have mercy on this weary soul. So we stopped about an hour before we sat down to eat dinner, pulled into a rest area, and uh, opened up a couple cans of new potatoes and, and added them. And since they're already really cooked, we just wanted them to get warmed up real good and, uh, and get some of that flavor. Okay, so here's, uh, here's what we wound up with. Um, you can see it's now dark outside. We are shut down. And um, here is what we wound up with. Man, that looks good. We, uh, we've got a giant roast. Let's see this here. And we seasoned it with that um, onion soup mix. Got some uh, carrots in there and uh, some, some whole new potatoes. And oh my gosh, I wish you guys could smell this. It's really good. So again, we, we don't do anything special here. This is just all stuff that, that you can buy at Walmart and uh, it all just runs off of our inverter in the truck. Um, and it's just so easy to do. We just threw everything into the, uh, into the pressure cooker, turned it on and drove down the road and let our meal cook. So now we've had a great meal that, uh, that really is good for you and um, easy to do. And now we got a little bit of coffee brewing we are ready to settle in for the night. See you guys. Bye.